Prices are below $4 this week, but experts say they could reach around $5 later on this summer, even by Memorial Day. ABC 6's Walter Allen is live outside of our studios now with a, a cost-saving item you can install in your car, Walter. Yeah, Bob, it's called a hydrogen generator, and it goes on your engine right here. We're told it increases your gas mileage, but we, got in our, we brought in our car expert to make sure it's the real deal. They're hovering right around $4 a gallon right now, putting on about 400 miles a week. Expect to go up to $5 by summer. Oh, a little over 40 bucks to go ahead and supply that for a week. So instead of wasting a lot of oxygen on complaining, it needs to resurface and come back again. Steve Conroe is splitting oxygen and hydrogen away from water with a hydrogen generator he installed on his car. Electrolysis means you're using electric current to go ahead and split water molecules back into two parts of hydrogen, one part oxygen. So all that white that you're seeing is the hydrogen being split right now. The hydrogen goes into the air filter and helps the engine burn the gasoline cleaner. Gone up to 50 miles per gallon, which is a 20% increase. Increase your gas mileage by 20%? Well, if it sounds too good to be true, it usually is. So we open it up to our car guide to see if it's legit. So what does it do now? What's the O2 sensor? Shooting in like a nitrous oxide wood? Is that a Nerf football down there? Yeah, it is. How often do you refill it? Where do you buy hydrogen? <laughs> How about temperature? After a thorough inspection, Dan Boots Longinette says he likes the idea. <laughs> I love it. You say Boots, you sold? I think I am. Now, Conroe tells us that uh, after watching a do-it-yourself video on YouTube, it took him about four hours and $40, but it was easily installed. Boots says it's not for a beginner mechanic. You need to know what you're doing and also make sure you're not in violation of your warranty. For now, we're live outside our studios. Walter Allen, ABC 6 News.